Hey guys, this is Kristen and I'm going to tell you what kind of Gucci stuff I have, like when did I buy it and where did I buy it. So let's go, let's check it. Let's start with my Gucci collection. I, I've got my first Gucci when I was like 20 years old. It was like two years ago. I want to start with my rings because my rings, they mean so much to me. My first ring I got in Milan and I was at the fashion week. I went to Monte Napoleona, one of like my favorite streets. It has a lot of different shops, it has boutiques. So I got there and I couldn't stop staring at the ghost collection ring. So I got this ring and now I'm in love with it. I wear it like every day, every day of my life. Like the only time I'm not wearing it like is when I'm sleeping. The other ring I've got, uh, I've got it like half of a year ago during the summertime. I was going back from Milan Fashion Week and I totally forgot that I had like the same ring from the ghost collection but with the ghost so when i got to the airport i saw a small gucci boutique and they had like only jewelry so i, I saw that ring and i fell in love with it and i totally forgot that i have the same ring but just with the ghost so when i got that ring i just compared them and they're like almost the same and i was like Oh my god, I'm so stupid. But I'm still happy with my rings by Gucci because they have style, they are unique and they are matching with my nails, they're matching with my style and I'm really happy with them. The other ring I have is um, this Gucci ring which I got like on my birthday. Uh, it was like my 22nd birthday like a month ago. I was also in Milan and I was going to the Gucci shop and um, when I saw this ring I was like very obsessed with that because it reminds me of Rococo style, it reminds me of Marie Antoinette, one of my favorite fashion icons ever. So I didn't even think about uh, should I buy that or not, I just got it like in two seconds because it's, it's, like, it's me, this ring is me, like when you see me you don't get like my style you, you think that I'm like super goth but inside of me I'm very pink I'm very cute uh, I love 18th century so I think this ring is uh, it shows my soul it shows my lifestyle inside of me also I got these socks they're very unique they remind me of uh, Christmas time or they remind me of I don't know they remind me of happiness and these socks I've got from my really close friend he owns the magazine and we were sitting at the bar i think it was in the bar and we were having lunch and i was very mad at him because i don't know he fucked up like a few times so when he got to the bar he just brings me a gucci present and i'm like really shocked like dude come on you're giving me a real gucci present and he made me so happy like i couldn't even talk like really dude you're you're giving me fucking Gucci, I'm so happy. So I got these socks and they match with my pants from my collection and I wear them every time I want to look cute and tiny and sweet and girly. So these socks, they're very cute. These glasses, I got them in London and it was one year ago last summer. I just went to the street, I forgot the name of the street, so there, there were like a lot of boutiques and I saw that these glasses and I thought of very old style, like retro style culture. I decided I had to have them, they're not like like super my style, but they are matching with uh, some office looks and they can make you like a little bit extra. So I love to wear them whenever I feel serious about something or I feel like I want to impress someone with my retro style. Okay, so let's check another pair of my glasses. Oh, this, this, this is my first ever pair of Gucci glasses. I bought them in Moscow and it was a very bad idea to buy them in Moscow because in Moscow they are pretty expensive. If you buy them in Milan or Paris you get tax free when you go home so they are like cheap. So this is like my favorite ever pair of Gucci sunglasses. 
I don't remember, it's like spring, summer 16 or 17, I think 16 collection, I don't remember, sorry. So I was dreaming of them like for a year, I think. And um, then I got to Paris, I tried them on and I was like, they're so pretty, they're looking so extra, they remind me of late 20s and um, every time I saw like a celebrity wearing them, I was like, wow, that's so pretty. And then I got to Milan, again to Milan during menswear fashion week and I couldn't stop, I couldn't stop, I got them and since that time they're always with me, like I'm wearing them like every day in every particular reason, they're with me. I turned 21 and yeah again I was in Milan all the time, I'm in Milan, I buy myself some Gucci. So I went to the shop and on that time it was very hyped uh, collection, Hollywood collection of sunglasses, they had like very different uh, collection, uh, very different sunglasses with pearls or with diamonds. So I was in love with this model and this model it has unique package it's written hollywood collection inside and i save it like every day I, I, like i have it on my table i'm just staring at this and i'm like oh my god this is a masterpiece so when you open it it's like a pair of transparent uh, glasses with pearls and also this pair of glasses i also lost like some pearls but gucci store they they uh, like helped me to repair this pair i wore them like with my super extra looks i love wear these sunglasses with like my super wigs i love matching them with my black wigs with my pink wigs like long hair catchy style like very very uh, like sexy style and like red lips for example uh, sometimes i wear with my hair when i have like red lips it's like every time i wear them the thing i love about like gucci sunglasses and gucci everything uh, this brand it has a very deep connection with the customer they have amazing DNA and uh, their new story is the story of young aged girls and boys who love vintage, who love to feel themselves pretty and they're feeling themselves like flowers. So all things are in amazing, beautiful pockets. I got, I got this top when I was in Russia, I was in Krasnodar. Krasnodar is like a city far away from Moscow and um, they have a big, big boutique uh, and a lot of Krasnodar people, like when they go shopping, like if they go shopping, they go to that place. It's called Angel Boutique. So I was like at my friend's place there and she has, she owns that boutique. So I went there and she showed me this uh, top and this is uh, one of the latest collections. So I got this top because it was pretty cheap and she made me like a discount. So I was like, for sure I'm taking this. And I feel bad about this um, sticker because I don't know if I'm really, like, I don't know how it's called, like sticker or like, something else like like logo it's like falling off so i'm just like i need to repair this like as soon as i can but i wore this a lot i wore this to frankie morella fashion show during spring summer season menswear fashion week and like i was half naked i was like wearing this one by like one side and it was like my swimsuit here like i was almost like naked but then I got to her in person presentation and he loved my outfit and it was like lit this this is like my first expensive Gucci bag I mean all Gucci bags are expensive but this is my first um, thing which I got like very expensive because like I have some expensive sunglasses but this thing it was first i think i spent all my money on the time it was one and a half year ago i spent like all my money on this bag and i didn't regret that at all like i was dreaming about this bag when i got to the store which store i just saw that bag and i was wearing like crocodile leather jacket and it matched and i was like i need this bag i just got it like because i love the way it matches with my outfit and like i didn't get it on that time i got it like 
two months later, my friend, she went to Milan and I was like calling her and asking like, can you help me please? Can you get me this bag? Because it's going to be sold out real soon because this collection, it was very exclusive with the customization and she got it for me and she brought it to Moscow and I was very happy to wear it. Okay, so what else do I have? I have, I have this, I don't know, oh. Oh my god, I have the whole story about these glasses. These glasses, they were like my dream as other glasses I got. So when I was like thinking to buy these glasses, I was leaving Milan and when I left to Moscow, I called my friend to pick them up and he was like going back to Moscow like one day later, so he had a time to buy it for me. And I wanted another pair of pink glasses. There is like a model with a big shape of this part sorry i'm not that good at english so i wanted another type of these glasses and he brought me this and when i just opened my package i was like literally crying because i wanted another pair and i was like so shocked but later i just started wearing them and i was happy with this model because this model it's like very romantic very cute and girly and i think it's better to have one girly glasses rather than having all like super super i don't know super red <laughs> what about them i got them like one month ago when i was in london i had like my birthday and i think like I really wanted this pair of glasses like they are from I think spring summer 18 collection I'm not sure sorry so when I was in London I, I knew that I would buy them so I just went to strictly to that shop and I got them like like in one second I was like hey guys I need this pair of glasses they were like do you want to think no I want to buy them so I got them and now I feel like a rock star because this pair of glasses it's like everything I can wear them everywhere. I know they're like super extra, they're like super shiny and every time I'm going to the party and I want like super extra, super like a star, like everyone stares at these glasses, everyone thinks like I'm a celebrity so I'm wearing this pair of glasses like when I want to be like super on top. I also have some hair accessories and the first one the black one i got for my birthday my friend a stylist uh, he got me it like very randomly so we went to the gucci shop and i just i was checking out everything new and i was like oh my god i love this i love this hair accessory it looks so good and it would look very good on, on my fake hair like on my wigs and when i was about to pay he just put his card and he paid for that and he said like happy birthday Kristen." and it's like I was so shocked because my birthday was like two weeks or three weeks later and it was like very random and I was so happy with that I'm really thankful thank you boy this one I don't remember where I got I don't remember actually sorry I, I'm just like yeah I forgot where I got it like really forgot no idea I think it was in Paris or okay whatever but I wear it like uh, with the black caps like I wear like baseball caps and I just put this on and uh, it's like uh, the whole new style also, also I love to wear it like with my white wigs and like other wigs it looks very good it, it fixes hair so fake hair it looks really natural that's why I love these things I love it my feelings about Gucci is that this brand is everything people want. This brand has a good DNA, this, ha this brand has everything you want. It, has, it makes you feel like a star, it makes you feel comfortable, it makes you feel lovely and loved. That's why I love this brand. But this brand, it costs pretty expensive because this is a luxury brand. And the thing that they did they made the young generation love this brand that's why i respect the new team i respect the new designer i respect everything they do now and when people say like oh like it's been like few seasons he's doing the same collections okay but try to make it like him try to make such good sales i'm pretty sure that few years more and gucci will be even more popular and i hope they will do that i hope they will keep going with like extra style extra collections because this style it's crazy and it matches my style so 
I suggest you to check out more about Gucci. Every campaign of Gucci is like very unique and they are working on it in very hard. I, I, when I see it, like it's the whole story about every photo shoot, it's the whole story about every collection. And that's why we all love this brand. That's why this brand is going to be alive for a lot of years.